Hey everybody, Kelly Ritchie here. Welcome to the cutting edge. So what's new for December? Well, let's dive in and see. First off, it is the last month of 2020, and this has been such a difficult year for so many people. I hope you're staying safe, and uh, I hope you've had a good Thanksgiving holiday, and I hope you are preparing for uh, the holiday season and using your creativity to find new ways to be safe and have fun and to um, have a good holiday. Now, a couple of things I want to point out in the channel. There is a, a section that has a deep dive into all of my pedal boards. So if you're thinking about getting some gear for Christmas, don't know what to get, go through some of those. Each pedal board that I put together, I have the same core overdrive structure. Using two overdrives in combination, it's part of my sound, so check that out. The core sounds that I have are my overdrive, a wah, and uh, my delays. So just check those out if you're looking for ideas, sound creation, what to get. You'll see a lot of different brands, the way that I have things set up. So be sure to do that since it's Christmas. This is the time that a lot of people are getting gifts or buying themselves those certain treats. Now, what I'm adding as far as new content, I've got a mini series that is a continuation on the GoPro series. However, now I have a three camera shoot. I'm using an iPad to shoot down the neck of my guitar. It allows me the flexibility to turn a bit to show some things that just a simple GoPro can limit a little bit of the view. So there's that and the four songs that I'm teaching in this mini series, they're all in the key of A. There's My Baby's Gone Crazy, which is a shuffle. It's a flat tire. It forces you into that flat tire feel. Everybody wants that Stevie Ray thing. This song will really push you into that. Then we look at a song called Tears Like Rain. And then Red House, and um, finally Crossroads. There's just a lot of things in these four songs that sing the guitar head on can be missed. So I'm gonna do a little mini series on all four songs with highlights that show techniques and it moves us into the key of A. So far we've been focusing on the key of E. I'm a strong believer that uh, if you know the key of E and the key of A, you're really prepared to move around the neck because root five pentatonic in the key of E is centrally located. Root six pentatonic in the key of A is centrally located. And so many songs are in one of those two keys in the blues rock genre. And then finally, I have a new mini series that I'm adding to the channel. And it's just some, some real basic things that people struggle with. One, a lot of times I'll start a lesson with a student and they won't be in tune. So maybe they just didn't grab their tuner, they didn't take time, or maybe they don't really know how to tune. Uh, maybe they can't find their tuner and they're not sure how to tune by ear. So I just covered some basic things about tuning. And secondly, people will say, man, by the time I've done my finger exercises, it's taken me 30 minutes and I don't feel like practicing. That's a problem. You don't want to burn yourself out on doing a warm up, but you do want to do a warm up. So we look at finger exercises, how to best execute them to get the most out of them and not wear yourself out, okay? Uh, how to learn them, and then as you progress, how to use just one for your warm up, but also how to play with a metronome. That would be the third thing. People really struggle uh, syncing up with the metronome, playing quarter notes, playing eighth notes, playing 16th notes, and then how to do a rhythm exercise, number four. It's a really important series that I hope you'll take time to watch. Whether you're an absolute beginner or whether you've been playing for a while and you're intermediate, please watch this because there's little nuggets in there that really make a big difference, okay? So I hope you have a wonderful holiday. Dive in and have some fun. If you're making some headway, record a video that you wanna share with the channel, please do. If you have questions um, or you want me to cover something in the coming months, post those on the forum. Let me know, let me know how you're doing and uh, you take care. Be safe, practice hard. I'll see you next year.